Hello there everyone! How you all doing? It's yours truly this small GT speaking here and welcome back to this Empire Total War Let's Play of Westphalia! We are in a pickle here! Great Britain has declared war on us just because we took care of Portugal here but then again it's most likely Württemberg's fault for they being at war with Great Britain but that doesn't matter right now. We are in a very bad spot right now. Great Britain has blockaded our main port, not to mention that Spain has blockaded our port that is down here in France, and we are almost bankrupt. I am just thankful that we didn't get bankrupt the last turn. If that would have happened, we would have been utterly screwed. But I have a plan of how we're gonna be able to take down Great Britain. What I want to do is that we're gonna take this army, we're gonna march up to London, and take down Great Britain. I have no idea if they're even gonna have an army stationed there or not, but I can take this sloop right here, because I want to see, because these guys cannot reach all the way to the port, so they have to stop somewhere around here, I'm gonna take the sloop from this fleet right here, but I can't do it if there's gonna be a ship station right here. So I can only hope to God that there's no one here. There's no one there. Is do you have an army here? Oh, it's not. Oh, it's not as big as I thought it was gonna be, and that's perfect. Oh, that is working out so damn well. But of course, it could be. It could somebody up here in Scotland and Ireland, but. Oh, this is such a bad spot to be in. And yes, I am semi-panicking here. Because Great Britain, historically, had such a strong-ass navy, it's pretty much almost impossible to challenge it. And quite frankly, we're just a small German state that just happened to, be to have become big. And because we happen to be in the verge of bankruptcy, I think it might just be wise that we... Uh, Disband some of the guys that we got here. I mean, we got the we got uh, like such big town growth that I don't really think that bankruptcy is inevitable. But I think it would be safe just to do, to disband these guys just so we can actually save some money, and we're already saving up money by doing that. I am not gonna go ahead and disband these guys, however, because I'm having plans. Of trying at least to invade Jamaica but of course I can't exactly do that with this big ass army right here actually hold on a minute Great Britain do you know fire they don't know fire by rank they don't know fire by rank oh, oh well this is gonna this is this is getting interesting but this is getting interesting already I don't think I need to disband you guys I think you're fine there but yeah, next turn, we're gonna go ahead, try our best to invade England and take down Great Britain. I would never think that we have gone this damn far into this campaign just for it to get screwed over by Great Britain. This is going to be fun, exciting, and probably anxiety-inducing. Excite so let's go ahead and do this. Yeah, I suspected as much as you were gonna do this. This is, n quite frankly, this is not too, this is not too major of an army, really. I mean, you didn't bring, you brought one artillery, one fixed artillery. And these cavalry are not gonna do much, not to mention that one pike, man. So this is, this is in the bag. Right. Pike man, you're practically useless inside of these walls. So you're gonna be on the outside and just sh soak up some bullets and try and kill as many as you can. Using up the pikeman here is probably gonna be a good idea here because they can just try and kill as many guys as they can and if they even can they can march up and try and kill their artillery that they got but I don't really think they're gonna be able to reach that point. Although hold on does that one particular artillery that the Great Britain have, does it know canister shot? 
I'm, I'm very certain that that is probably the, the worst artillery in the game. Just when it comes to stats and all, but I don't really know if it actually knows, like, canister shot or not. But if it does, then my pike man is not gonna be able to do jack squallily dick. Like, I only know for sure that the demi canis, if I, f I think they're called that, they can definitely know, they do know canister shot and everything. Shit, I don't know what to place you guys. You know what? You can actually be outside. I don't have any ideas where to place you on the walls, so you can just be outside. Now, let's see here. Where the heck is the... Oh, it's on that side? Why did you place your artillery on this side? Hold on, where the hell is it? Oh. That's a very funny... That's a very funny place to put it. Alright, well, Pike Man, you can go ahead and head over there. You can head over there. You can just you can just sit there and be cute, I guess. You can increase your line just a little wee bit. And let's do this. Let's see, where the hell are you firing at? The damage there. Are you, ev are, you ev are you even gonna be able to reach? I don't think you're gonna be able to reach me that far away with that artillery. It does not look like it, at least. Alright, Pike Man. I wonder... I don't really think I can even... I don't think that artillery is actually gonna become a problem, actually. Like, it doesn't seem to reach. Just barely, even. No, well... We have nothing to worry about at all, then. Square formation there, Pike Man. Square formation right there. You're probably gonna get mowed down by the, the cannons on the fort. But hey, you're doing God's work here, sons. You're doing God's work here. Oh, really? You already wait. You already routed. Dang, come on, Pike Man. I know you're stronger than that. But then again, you came from the fucking civil reserves, or whatever the heck you want to call those grey spots right there. But of course, uh, of course you're gonna route that easily. I mean, you can see the different stats of these guys. They haven't really made a big move on. Oh, there we go. Okay, that's a cavalry. Let's see if you can put a square formation on you. Oh, you guys are actually holding up pretty well. That's good. So you're winning slightly, that's good. At least you're holding up better than that one other pike, man. Winning slightly, that's good. You're winning slightly, that's good. Alright, fire hell upon them, guys. We ain't gonna let these tea druggies take this little beautiful land that is called France. It shall remain German for all times and eternity. I think it was a bad idea to put you guys outside of here. You're not, yeah. Uh, it was probably a bad idea to place you there, but I didn't know anywhere else to place you, so. I hate him watching around on that side of the fort. Man, I think it was a good idea to place you guys out here. At least you're doing something against these guys. You're even making one of the- Oh uh, no, it was cavalry. That got there, I got excited for a, for a second that my pike was actually managing to get one of the line infantry to wave. But, nope. Like, Great Britain, I am sorry for what I did to Portugal, but they had it coming. They thought that our new ruler was a piece of shit, which he's not. He's a pretty cool doodledo, uh, but then again, he, he does- he does suck uh, in a way, but... Yeah, it was incredibly rude of them. We're not gonna stand for it. And it's more likely it's just Portugal's fault. It's their fault. It's their fault that they got destroyed. I mean, quite frankly, Great Britain, you didn't even join in on their side. You just left them to be destroyed. If you were such a big bro of Portugal, you should have joined in. You should have joined in on their side. Or were you afraid that little old me was gonna come and just destroy your ass or something like that? I mean, Great Britain, that, I mean, sure, that would have probably happened, but... You, you, you left me. You didn't leave me in a vulnerable spot. You left yourself in a vulnerable spot. 
and we're gonna show you how bad of an idea this was. God damn it, I really hope this is not gonna turn out to be incredibly racist or not. I want to be clear here. Everything that is going to sound incredibly racist or not, I don't mean it literally. This is all for shits and giggles. It's virtual racism, okay? Anything I say here against your nationality or anything, it's just torch the game. The game makes me wanna hate your nation. Alright? We're square on that, okay? I don't hate Great Britain, the game wants me to hate them. What the hell is happening over here? Okay, guys, that is just ruthless. Leave these two small boys out of here. Oh, well, they're not small boys, but come on. They just want to live, Great Britain. You ruthless animals, leave these two guys alone. Now, this is what I'm saying. Great Britain, is, uh, Great Britain is an asshole. They're a, they're bona fide assholes. They're chasing those two little guys. They just want to live, have a good life, and they just say, "No, you, you're gonna die because you're German." What a bunch of racist assholes! Are you just gonna stand there, just standing there and not doing anything? I am not coming outside of these walls, Great Britain. There's no way I'm doing that. The hell are you doing? I mean, come on, I'm waiting for you. Please come to me. Or are you sitting here and just realizing what kind of big mistake you're getting yourself into, eh? Okay, now they're moving. <laughs> I guess Great Prison doesn't like when I'm trying to roast the living shit out of them. If you want to agitate the Brit, roast the shit out of them. But then again, I that is probably not. Glorified roasting her. <laughs> but hey, if it had to chase them, good enough for me. Also, I think I'm going to point out I'm not too terribly concerned that we're going to lose this at all. We got this. We have fought hard from the small, small region of Rylands into this big ass nation that we have become right now. We are sure as hell not going to back down from Great Britain. You may have a very scary navy there, Great Britain, but we, we have a dumbass commander that is me, leading the charge. And there's one thing you should be scared about, is stupidity. Stupidity always finds a way, and you'll be damned to see that it actually works. Okay, you're wavering, you're wavering, that's good, army losses, perfect. Uh, who is not? That's all of them, right? Oh god, damn it, you're coming back! Can somebody shoot him, please? Uh, all right, come on, get out of here, get out of here, chumps, get out of here. That should be the last of line infantry. Yeah. Right, we got this. I just need to chase that army down because I'm pretty sure if I just let them be. They probably are either gonna go to Amsterdam or Flanders. I can't really afford to lose a region. I mean, even though our town wealth is completely fine, just losing a region is probably gonna be detrimental to our income. Also, I really hope I don't sound too gibberish and stuff. I mean, quite frankly, I have only been awake for two hours and such. So, I, uh, I really don't know how to commit, uh, the speech. But hey, if you're an idiot, you can't talk at all. Yeah, oh yeah, you, lo you lost the majority of them. I really wonder if I can chase them down. Not gonna challenge that. Ah, uh, you captured it, but it's fine, it's just a sloop. No, no, no worries, no worries. I'm starting to wonder if... I don't remember giving Poland uh, infinite military access. Maybe that's the reason why they haven't attacked us yet. Here's the thing. Once we're done with Great Britain, I feel like... Because Austria happens to be at war, well, for the moment at least. Uh, 
are at war with Poland, so I feel like we could join in with them. Um, no, Maratha Confederacy, I do not want to give you that. Yeah, oh, our king died. It wasn't here for a long time, but... Well, at least you served your cause there, mate. Alright, how many of you survived? Alright, I can e I can easily take that. But for now... I need to make sure that... Wait, let's see... So even... Um, um, um... <laughs> well, funny saying that, um... Uh, I don't... I can't... I can't... I'm sorry, Zoe, I can't do that. I bet you're gonna go ahead and take that. But anyways... Now... Place you guys here. You can only hope there's enough move points in this sloop to take them there. We have one. We have one shot at this. We have one shot. You're not even. You're not gonna be able to reach, are you? <sighs> well, we have one shot at this, people. We have one shot at this. We could go. And take Ireland. But I feel like it's way better to take London. It's Britain, most wealthy region. Place them. Pla no, don't do this to me. Don't do this to me. Just fucking place them, will ya? I swear to Christ, if you're gonna stop right where you are and not got them, place them. Why are you not placing them there? Why are, you, why are you not placing the- Oh, I swear to Christ, if you are gonna do me like that, I am not losing that army! Oh fuck, I can't believe you've done this. You absolute shit. Who, where is that sloop? Get out of here. Come on, can, can I place you guys? Why don't you wanna- Why don't you wanna place there? Oh well, I don't really think the fleet that Great Britain got here, I don't think they're gonna engage with me. Well, hopefully, I, I really, really hope they do not. God damn it, we should have gone with Ireland. Let me see. Well, I'm too busy with Great Britain, I don't want to go up against you guys. Hold on. Let me beseech you. Go back here. Can I, like, do this? There, can I disembark you guys? There we go. Why you why we why were you the way that you were last time? There we go. I don't know if it's a good idea to auto resolve this. It might be a better way just to play this battle out. Like they have a shit ton of pike man. Although that's not gonna do do much. Alright, I think it's safe uh, we have to play this battle. Because I, I want Great Britain gone as fast as possible. Oh. Who is this kind of fort, eh? Let's see. Uh, let me see. How about I put my artilleries in the middle somewhere? We'll destroy one part of the wall. One part of the wall here so we can attack from two fronts here. It's probably, probably going to be the same idea like we did with Portugal. But hopefully this time, it's actually gonna be a good idea. Because when we were attacking Portugal, the damn hilly terrain is what messed us up. And I'm gonna do the same idea. Send in my, send in my pike man. They're gonna choke up most of the damage. Also, I think I'm gonna place... Just so that you can provide a distraction. You can be placed over there. And the rest of you guys can... And you can just stand there and be cute, I guess. And I did the same mistake as I fucking did with Portugal. Putting you in square formation instead of grouping you up. God damn it. Alright, let's see here. A couple of guys there. I think we can go ahead and focus on... That first. Yeah, and you're gonna shoot straight at that. I'm gonna keep my units hidden for now. You, however... 
Yeah, I need to move you guys out of there. Are you outside? Are you outside of there? Ah, eh, heck. I only want these walls to get destroyed as soon as possible. <laughs> right, God damn it! I never thought I would have so much anxiety just because of one bloody nation. But Great Britain, quite frankly, is somebody that you don't want to particularly me to mess with. Like, I, I can go ahead and say this, just from experience by playing the game. I mean, I've been playing as some of the minor factions in this mod here, and if you're not a landlocked nation, Great Britain is gonna go- it's going to attack you at the start of every single campaign that you do. And I'm not joking about that. For some reason, the game really likes to punish you for playing a nation that you normally shouldn't be able to play. And Great Britain wants to emphasize on that. I mean, I want to go ahead and just play as good old Georgia. Great Britain has no... They have no deals to be there. But what do you know? Like, like 20 or so turns later, they just navally made me for God knows why. Also, how comes you're not doing... Guys, you are firing on the, the fort now, are ya? You should have you should have fired another barrage by now. There we go, that's what I want to see. It's gonna take a while to break that wall. I'll be back once we have done some actual progress. There we go, that's good. Halfway there. Hmm, I wonder if you're gonna pay attention to this Great Britain. I have an idea. Try to see if you can climb up that wall right there. Let's see, Great Britain, are you gonna pay attention to that or are you just gonna pay attention to those, these little guys over here? I'm pretty sure the AI is not gonna let me get away with that, but we'll see. Alright, I think I can go ahead and start moving up my pike, man. There we go. Come on, guys. Oh, what the hell? Okay, I don't really think it's natural for a cannonball to bounce like that, but hey, what the hell do I know about physics? You guys are climbing up the wall right here. I don't really think you can challenge the militias that are up here, but hopefully you can. Get up on the get up there quickly though before they start bloody well engaging you in melee. Uh, I really hope I'm not doing this too early with my pike man here. Oh, come on, guys! What the hell are you aiming at? Why are you firing over the wall for? Yeah, come on, that's what I want to see. I got to be, you missed again. Guys, come on. Rip Britain is literally laughing at us right now. One more cannon. Yeah, there we go. Perfect. Pike man, go ahead and do your thing. Let's go ahead and start firing on the other side. And I think it might be time. Maybe you can go ahead and climb that wall. And maybe I can send in my cavalry in here. Even if we decide to get an opening, that is. I don't know if we really are. Start firing on my guys on the walls here. But it, it, I think it's okay. I think it's fine. Okay, building captured. Which one? That one. Uh, let's see. I hope that's gonna be opened... Long enough for my missile cavalry to arrive there. I'm gonna put fire, fire right well off on you. And maybe it, it should be time for us to move up our line infantry as well. Now the Great Britain, that most of uh, Great Britain's units are not gonna be on the walls. This should be an opportune time to do it. Oh yeah, I can actually charge in with my cavalry here, especially you. 
or maybe not. Oh no, wait, they're stationed like that. Okay, that's not a good idea. They're just gonna shoot my. They're just gonna shoot my cavalry on sight. We see how are you guys holding up. You're winning slightly. That's good. You're going against. Uh, you're going against militia, so you sh that shouldn't be a problem. Man, are they doing this intentionally? I mean, I tend to do this kind of strategy when my walls go down. I never seen the AI do this kind of trick before. But if well, if you're gonna go ahead and do that, you're gonna destroy my pikemen by doing that. Hmm. Well, if that's going to be the case, start climbing the start climbing the wall right there. Uh, shit. Okay, you're actually walking away. That's good. Okay, you can st go ahead and stop running. Go ahead and start walking towards the fort there. I don't know if there's any reason to actually climb the walls right now. All I just want is just to get inside of there and, and just get to the middle point as fast as possible. Alright, let's see if we can get in here. Wait, do you have fiber rank now? Oh, God damn it! you have fiber rank now. Uh, Great Britain, you didn't have fiber rank a second ago, but now you have it? God damn it! make up your mind, man. Make up your mind. Uh, let me see, has my artillery got... Artillery, what the hell? I'm telling you to fire on this wall here. Why aren't you doing it? You better not be bugging out like you did in Portugal. Alright, that's good, guys. Go ahead and start walking over there. There we go, now just start firing at it. Oh, Jesus. They're tired, that's good. You can actually charge at them. I want you to try to get in the middle if you can. How are you guys, guys holding up? You're about to kill them, that's good. How are you guys holding up? You're winning slightly, that's good. Are you gonna challenge me there, Great Britain? No, that's a good idea. And here comes my pikemen. Arriving just in time. Take care of those guys over there. While the other two... Are gonna go ahead and take care of the rest. Just, uh... Okay, I don't want both of you to be in here. Uh... Just get out of there if you can. Oh, fuck's sake! Just get out of- just get out of that. That's just- that's a big-ass death trap for you. Okay, that's good. Now, let's see who- okay, that's the general. Fire on him. Okay, pikeman, that's good. Got our first route, and they're starting to find their artillery at us, but it's fine. We got this. I hope. Building captured. Which one? That one. Good. That's good. You can go ahead and start climbing the walls, lads. And I'm pretty sure I don't need to have my artillery. I don't need to use my artillery anymore. Quite frankly, can I send in my... Can I send in my cavalry in here without them being disturbed? You wait, you're wavering! What are you wavering for? And my frames completely died. Shit. Well, got them. Well, there goes my frames. I have to apologize for that, but hey, there's not much I can do about it. God damn it. I got a new PC just for this very mo just for this very reason, just because I had such uh, so many problems with black screens and stuff like that, and now the frames just decides to die on me. Do a square formation. Well, I really don't know if it's a good idea to put square formation on Pike Man, especially when you're going up against infantry and such. I really don't know if that's a good idea or not. Damn it, you routed. How are you guys holding up? You're holding up good. Uh, you can just go ahead, go ahead, go up on the wall, stop firing on them. Oh, shit! Take care of that artillery if you can! Oh, that is bad. That is really bad. Alright, you guys can be stationed up here. Oh, that's good, guys. That's really good. The invasion of London is happening.
Oopsie, can you really fire on these guys? Uh, no, you can't really. Oh, maybe you can. No, you're just gonna walk towards them. Ah, fuck it then. Come on, Pike Man, you got this. I brought you into this fight for a very good reason. Let's see, cavalry. Uh, char no, those, those are Pike Men. You don't want to do that. Uh, oh, Captain, why, Great Britain? Why the fuck do you have so many Pike Men? Why? Why did the Why did the game decide to give you so many damn Pike Men? Uh, I think that's the general. I, I want to kill off the general. Maybe it'll be an easier time for them to rout. Wait, what the hell happened here? The oh shit! I didn't see them attack my artilleries. Uh, I really hope my general can hold its weight here. If he dies, we're fucked. One of my pikemen has routed. We're still doing okay. Damn it, I can't engage with the pikemen at all. Damn it, I don't think my general can even win this. Alright, might as well go ahead and go uh, YOLO on this. Please, artillery, don't don't kill my general here. Shit. Also, I don't want you to rout either. Ah, oh, damn it. God damn it, they put a Great Britain put a sneaky on me. They straight they straight up put a sneaky on me. At least I got my missile cavalry in here now. See, are you guys holding up well in there? No, you're losing slightly. Okay, make sure. Damn it. Their pikeman is causing so much trouble for us. Only got one more pikeman here. See, uh, take care of their pikemen right in front of you there. They're gonna run back and trying to kill my artillery there. Damn it. General, are you really gonna go? Ugh, well, at least they didn't kill you, so I, I guess it's fine on that end at least, but... Damn it, I didn't think they were gonna go off and do something like that. One shot to do this. We all know that we have one shot in doing this. But then, yeah, we have multiple shots of doing this. But I just want to do this. Just this. We need to do this right now. These pikemen are causing a big, big problem for us now. What else can we do, really? But I send you guys on inside the walls like that, and you shoot it from behind. Maybe that'll work. See, ah, oh, god damn it, guys! Stop harassing my missile cavalry! God damn it! How much time do we have? Okay, twenty-three minutes. That should be more than enough time to actually do it. You're firing down there. I think it might be good to actually bring you guys down here. Who the hell are you guys? Where the hell are the rest of you? Hold on, where the hell are the rest of you are? Oh shit, they're right up here? What the hell? Well, go ahead and take care of that. I don't want to see any of that. Pikeman, fucking hell. I thought I was a drummer dude for a second there just because of the size of them. Let's see, uh, I don't think that pikeman is going to become uh, a problem anymore, so I think it would be fine for you guys to go down here. I only hope that your cavalry is not going to charge right at us as soon as we go down those walls. 
Well, since you are gonna be uh, occupied with them, uh, I guess you guys can go ahead and go down there. God damn it. There's so much stuff happening here that I'm having a hard time to micromanage all of this. Where the hell did this- Oh wait, that's right! They had cavalry reinforcements, well, two of them at least. I completely forgot about that. No wonder why they completely destroyed my artillery by doing it. Did you manage to kill those guys? Some of them are still there. You're, uh, you, uh, you should be able to take care of these pikemen. You got this, guys. You got this. Holy fuck. If we lose this... We can't lose this. There's no way we can lose this. Oh crap, the artillery is shooting at us. Let's see what's happening here. Go square formation just in case. I don't really have time for anyone to rout here. Okay, you, line infantry, if you can, get, in, get into the, the circle if you can. God damn it, take care of those bloody pikemen. That's good. Wait, are the two of you up here? Because when the hell then were the two of you guys up here? See, who is more... Okay, okay, listen to it there. Oh god, this sucks! Okay, I, I, I think I can send at least one of you guys off, off the walls. Holy crap, can somebody kill their artillery, please? You can go out of that. Go ahead and deal with that citizen militia. Don't mind us, we're just gonna go ahead go ahead and go behind ya. Why are you why are you uh guy no 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 you are not going down there fuck that I did not bring you guys in here just so you can go ahead and do something stupid as that Like look at this one pike man Oh I'm gonna stab him in the butt gonna stab him in the butt Can you just thank you I think that militia just shot that pike man That's a good one there. Just kill that cavalry so we can get into that circle. Never mind, we can already. Good. Get in there. Okay, you go ahead and start focusing on these guys on this side here. You go ahead and go ahead and go down there. See, uh, what the hell are you guys doing here? Oh, they're going down on this. Oh, they're going down to the middle right now. Square formation. I need to help up this line infantry right here. If I can, I need to keep you busy. I don't know if I even can do that in my current uh, current condition. Oh, that's a good one. Keep it up, lads. Keep it up. Okay, how about I move you guys back a little bit? You are planning on coming down now, are ya? God damn it, I hate this game sometimes. Winning slightly, that's good. Take care of that militia. Oh shit! I really hope my guys are not gonna be interrupted by this now. Ah, damn it, you got interrupted. Fuck. What the hell are you still- What the hell are you guys still doing here? I mean, they just been standing there for the entire bloody time and not doing anything. And I thought I told you guys to go back. You guys are doing some work down here. That's good. 
Come on, guys, just kill that militia already. Oh, you're active. You're very tired. Charge at him. You're gonna wave. You're gonna start wavering, I'm pretty sure of it. Dr. General. Go ahead and start moving up to the, to the circle. We only got nine different trees now. Took care of them. Get inside. Take care of this these pikemen right here. Fuck's sake. The pikemen has been a very big thorn in this battle right here. But we are gonna come out top. We ain't gonna let some <laughs> tea druggies to be the to be the best of us here. Look at that. We got a musket boy and a flag boy. You're not gonna just charge right at us, are you now? Man. These boys right here. They got balls of steel. And goddammit, for fuck's sake. Can I please have you guys move back? And just stop engaging with them in melee. Just stop doing that. I know that we're... I know that we're a little bit bloodthirsty for some English blood here, but we do not have time for that kind of shenanigans. At least you're holding up well. Right, time to move you up here. See, is everybody doing good on ammunition? You're almost out. You're doing well, even though you've been on the wall for most for the majority of the time. I hate this. God damn it, I hate this militia. Just move back. And start firing at him already. How much time do we have? Uh, about 15 minutes. Alright, start firing on those guys. What's happening here? You're winning, are you? Should be able to win this. I am getting a little bit concerned here. Also, I thought I told you guys to engage with them here. And why are you guys down here for? Get up on the bloody wall. Oh yeah, that's good. Well, now that we know that Great Britain has fire by rank. Taking down Great Britain is gonna become way harder now because of it. We got this. We don't need to worry about anything. Kill that militia! Good. I kill those other militias. God damn it, Great Britain, just surrender already. Is there like an incarnation of uh, an early Winston Wilshire? No, I think I just mis mis mispronounced his name. But for the love of God, surrender already! God damn it. We killed the majority of the forces right here. Just for the love of God, just surrender already, you little shits! Shoot at him. I know you want to. Just bloody well shoot at them. God damn it. That might work. Alright. You guys. Shoot at these guys right here. Just do anything so just so we can get just so we can get into that bloody circle. Just raise our flag, our glorious nation flag, upon British soil. Like you know how you're you're trying to build an empire. You're going to offend a good amount of people. And I think Great Britain can agree with me on that front. Good. Get into that bloody circle and stay in it. You Help them take care of that pike man. For some reason they can't seem to take care of one lonely pike man. Just stab him in the eye. 
or you can just shoot him and just completely miss him point blank. Jesus, holy hell, just... Can somebody kill this guy? Can somebody just kill... Thank you! You can't shoot him point blank. You can't bloody well kill him point blank. But we did it. We have taken London.